solutions uh, that hopefully in doing that we will change ourselves as a world. So I'm going to go through the sectors of the economy that produce greenhouse gases uh, with the question of who needs to do what. And what I want to point out is that each one of them uh, sets in motion a process of somebody who needs to be helped out. We need to help out each other to make it through this. And that's where we come in. We would notice that kind of thing. We would encourage that kind of thing. Everybody okay with us so far? Yes. We need David to sing a little a word. <laughs> no? <laughs> okay, at the end. So, a quarter of greenhouse gases come from land use, so that means farming for one thing. Who would have thought it? So industrial farming, they have one kind of crop, and big growers with big machines, and carbon petrochemical fertilizers. We need to shift it over to non-till, don't break up the soil kind of stuff, restorative agriculture and permaculture. Uh, it looks different. Plants are interplanted, like a forest is like a jungle is, and they actually take care of each other and help each other grow, and you don't need the pesticides, and you don't need the chemical fertilizers. A wonderful little movie to get the hang of that is Biggest Little Farm. I think it's on Netflix. Biggest Little Farm, it's a gem, it's sweet, and it gives you the real sense of how it all works. So a second kind of thing 